Yeah, boy, it's getting awfully spooky here in Arlington. In fact, I'm told the only thing alive in this yard is the grass. Yeah, big fans of Halloween around here. I'm a fan of Halloween. Notice the Easter egg? Well, a local Snohomish County woman is such a fan that she has created the ultimate map. The haunts, the attractions, and yes, you can even filter by who's given out king-size candy. We are big fans of Halloween in our house. Our whole family gets into it. Uh, we've been decorating our house uh, since like 2014. We started, you know, start small, add a bunch every year. I made a map of trick-or-treating and Halloween events. Um, it started off as just an Arlington map in 2020, and then I had a bunch of people, when I started making it, they were like, oh, I'm in Marysville, can I be on the map? I'm in Stanwood, can I be on the map? Well, why not just go all of Snohomish County, um, since there was so much interest. So that first year, we only had, I think, a couple hundred people on the map. This year, we're up to about 730 so far, but we're still taking address submissions. So up until midnight on the 30th, you can put in your address and I'll put it on the map. So um, has the houses that are passing out candy and decorating, um, and then you'll find you know your trunk or treats or pumpkin patches, uh, haunted houses in the area. Uh, kids who are allergic to different things, they, they need the non-candy um, options for them. So you can filter and see only houses and events handing out that sort of option for you. You can also filter uh, just by full-size candy bars. So, All right. just houses handing out full-size candy bars. So that's pretty cool. So I have a Facebook page called Snohomish County Holiday Maps. I'm hoping we can surpass last year's numbers too and get it even bigger and better, kind of grow it every year. And it's more fun for everybody, the more stuff that's on the map. <laughs>